This is Ethiopian Rector to Ethiopia Village. We're here in Ethiopia, Addis Ababa. And this is my fact against the clock. It might take me from a week to eight years. <laughs> Depends on, yeah, on how I'm feeling and what I'm feeling, yeah. But I've never made a track in 10 minutes, <laughs> ever. <laughs> Not even in a day. Yeah, I'm nervous a bit, but yeah, I like the challenge. So this is uh, the Open Records, the Ethiopia Village. This is my against the clock. Um, yeah, here we go, I guess. <laughs> um, I started.
pretty fast. <laughs> I ex yeah. I mean, I expected it to be really short, but yeah, it just went by. <laughs> I'm okay with it. <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna work on it some more, but yeah. For 10 minutes, I'm okay with it. Yeah, most of the samples I used, like the the, um, the drums and I, are like my own samples, like that I, I I use Ableton. So I like I, usually what I do is I uh, I like program drums and then I freeze them and flatten them to change them from MIDI to to yeah wave and yeah that's why I use loops because I I didn't see myself. Like programming drums in 10 minutes. <laughs> programming drums alone takes me like 30 minutes to an hour. So <laughs> yeah, um, yeah. So everything I did is loop based, and yeah. Um, I have a Karar sample in there that I took from uh, Kasa Tasama, and a vocal sample that I took from um, an, a female vocalist that work with like a year ago called Mimi and yeah um, she's an Asmari and yeah both are like traditional based um, uh, samples I use Ableton most of the time then on Ableton I add like things like machine tractor which I use to sample I run the sound through Ableton to like I mean uh, to yeah I use tractor as a sampling tool basically and machine tool and also reason as a sampling tool and yeah I mean getting the software is pretty easy but getting the hardware um, is pretty crazy because in our country like I don't know things are changing now so maybe they change that but I got my keyboard my controllers paying 300% tax so yeah but I've gotten four times the gear of this. <laughs> yeah, uh, censorship. <laughs> they say it's because uh, musical instruments and video instruments are luxury goods, but I'm not living a very luxurious life, so. <laughs> yeah, but it's mostly, I think it's for censorship mostly. But yeah. Uh, this was Ethiopian Records, Ethiopia Alleged, and this was my Against the Clock for Fact Magazine.